morning everyone so it's Tuesday July 9 and August 9 jeez when am I gonna realize it's August anyway it's my last day off from work but I thought I'd share today with you guys because I'm actually on my way to my theory exam which I'm very nervous about it's obviously one of the requirements of driving for Amazon is a license so I've been using my license from back home right because it's valid for one year um, from moving here but that's almost done in September so I have to get a full UK license and before you get that you need to take an exam like it's on the computer right um, <coughs> you pass that you move on to a practical test which is actual driving that I'm quite confident about because I mean I drive every day <laughs> but this theory exam I'm very nervous about because I know what I'm gonna do you guys know I can't afford to lose a job I don't know what I'm gonna do if I fail booking this exam is tough because there's limited slots and I think I booked this exam two weeks ago I hope today goes well I've done all the studying I can and I've been passing mock tests online so I mean I've prepared for it as best as I can so here's to hoping for the best That's the testing center That building right there It's like a 10 minute walk from our place 15 at my pace <laughs> right I passed okay so obviously I wasn't able to film inside you're not allowed to so when you get to the center um, so they ask for your ID <coughs> you're made to put all your things in a locker so like phone, um, anything, like literally cannot have anything in your pockets when taking the test. And then you sit down, there's an option for you to use headphones so like the questions can be read aloud to you um, by the computer but I didn't, I didn't choose to. There's a multiple choice part with like 50 questions and you have almost an hour, 57 minutes to complete them. And then there's a hazard perception test wherein like there's a video and then there are potential hazards around um, you have to click when you see the hazard there's 14 videos it takes forever I mean it's already 8:40. oh it's not so bad my test was scheduled at 8 I got there a bit before I was able to start almost immediately I suppose they're not so strict on times. So maybe you should just arrive beforehand, not really after. Maybe that's the part they're strict about. But as soon as you get there, it's not like you wait for everyone. Everyone does the test at their own like time and pace. So you do the test, you get out, they print the result out for you. And here I have the result. See? I passed. <laughs> the multiple choice part of the exam. I passed by one point so all I have to do is book a practical exam and then I'm um, get my full license so I passed without any like review I mean I didn't enroll in driving school here um, since since moving to the UK I passed through studying only traffic signs and the highway code 
I'll leave links to each down below just check it out in the description box there's a lot of courses I saw online that like guarantee you're passing the exam so courses ranging anywhere between 5 and 20 pound some even offer like guarantees um, pass on the first take or your money back things like that but my cheap ass wouldn't have it <laughs> I wasn't gonna pay anything for that so I really just studied traffic signs and the highway code so check those out um, if you're not confident enough then by all means take the course take the online courses but I wish you guys luck to those who are gonna take the exam I have one more test the practical test <clears throat> hopefully I got scheduled soon and pass but that's it for this video thank you guys for watching hope you learned something if you did like the video if you didn't still like the video comment if you have any questions about the exam about you know uh, anything basically and of course don't forget to subscribe to the channel amazon deliveries resume tomorrow